Good morning, it's your instructor Ann Teed and I am making another video. I'm trying to do these weekly to feel more connected and build a, a cohort where you um, have me discussing and talking about the key points and highlighting some things to think about. So we are in uh, session five and this week we're going to be discussing and learning about the work of Jessica Hoffman Davis and how it applies in the educational settings. And um, so far, you've everybody's been working so hard, writing very meaningful work on all the assignments. Um, and here's another opportunity to dig in and uh, really find out about the power of the arts uh, and how uh, children make sense, adults make sense of the world around them. So you'll enjoy the readings and activities for this week. This week also, you're going to be handing in your accordion book. So I wanna give you a couple options on that. The last thing, and I'm feeling it, the last thing is that everybody does this work and it's not celebrated and not viewed. Yes, it is for you and your development and your toolbox of education. But I would like to really see these books. And since we're virtual, how am I going to do that? So um, I'd like for you to create a product with your book, either photographing the pages and making a PowerPoint. You can do a voiceover if you know how to do that. Uh, that would be really great. An iMovie is, if you don't know how to make an iMovie, please take the time. Uh, mo most of you have a smartphone, hit record, make it a couple minutes, then send it into iMovie, which a lot of times it's a free version or it's like five bucks for that app. It is so worth it as an educator. And do a voiceover on that or record it of, um, you reading your book and showing the pages. Does it have to be ready for an Academy Award? No. So just like I set my phone up right now and I'm talking to you, it's casual. If I put my hand up and get a little unprofessional of the, the vision here, that's okay. I'd like to see you reading your book and if you don't wanna be on the screen, then do it that your book is being read and we hear your inflection of the words and uh, show the images. Or you can take still shots uh, of your book and make sure we see uh, every part of it. My concern is the upload uh, onto the Moodle that we get to see all the images. So hopefully you can play around with it. Um, you can always do a Dropbox or something like that. Um, let me know if you need help on that, but let's have, let's take the opportunity to share this work in a little more depth, a little bit more breadth, and um, they are due at the end of the week by Sunday. So um, you have some time to work out the bugs and go into your comfort zone, but also challenge yourself a little if you haven't made an iMovie of yourself. Um, and it's a very, if it's a very, very personal subject, um, you can email it to me if you don't want to broadcast uh, your book and your images and your story. Uh, to the full class, you always have that option. So hopefully that'll help. Um, and I am going to give commentary on part one of this uh, last week's assignment um, to give you feedback. I wanna respond, uh, everybody did such an incredible job of that awakened moment, that uh, moment of awareness, took it a very personal way. And I will be emailing you um, my comments, okay? So if you have questions, email me. Otherwise, we have uh, Columbus Day weekend coming up uh, in two weeks, but I am gonna send out a, a doodle invitation to all of you with three different dates so that I can have um, a Zoom with you. Um, I need to see you, I need to talk to you, and maybe there's two dates or three, but you'll get an invitation in Doodle where you pick the day that's best, and it might be a morning or afternoon or an evening session time, um, that you will be part of that group Zoom. So we might not have the whole full group, but I'm gonna reach out to find different times so that we get to talk. And if this is something everybody wants to do a little bit more of, some Zoom class um, participation, I am all for it. Um, this, the 
the obligations you have for this class are not to have to have a participation weekly in a class, just doing the work online, everything virtual. But if if there's some of you would like to have more of a, a group meet each week, I'm open to it. And we will have, uh, again, I'll send out a doodle to touch base where you will have to pick one of them so that we're discussing the midterm and where we are. I right, have a great, uh, great day, great week. Again, questions, let me know. I look forward to seeing your accordion books. Anybody struggling with it, ask away. I'm here. Have a great one. Bye.